Hi, I'm Mary Poplin with Boris FX, and we are happy to announce the Mocha 5.6 point release. Mocha 5.6 is a free point release for all owners of Mocha Pro or Mocha VR. While stereoscopic workflows are the main promoted feature, we'd like to share a few important features and fixes relevant to Mocha Pro users. One of the major features for our Mocha Pro users is the Mocha Plugin Autosave. The Mocha plugin now has an autosave to an external file location. Turning Mocha into a plugin has been a very popular feature as all of your Mocha work is saved back into your host project. However, we heard from our users that you wanted to see more project saving backup insurance while working inside the Mocha interface. We listened. Now, in Mocha 5.6, a user can set the autosave preferences so your Mocha session is always backed up. Another popular request that we have addressed is that you can now save the last used Mocha project open and export locations. No more tedious hunting for the same directory a hundred times. The open and export dialog retained the last used path location. There have been many bug fixes addressed as well. We have made RAM improvements in Nuke, fixed some Python errors that were causing script problems, removed blending now blends correctly, and a persistent manual tracking bug where the Surface tool would not update and keyframe correctly has been fixed as well. There have also been adjustments to the reorient, insert, and remove modules, and memory allocation on the GPU is more robust across the board. To find out more, see our release notes. Adobe also fixed the error that was causing copying shape data to the clipboard from Mocha to crash After Effects. This is in the new After Effects patch, so you will need to pick up the latest download of Adobe AE CC 2018 to address this issue. If you have any more questions, I am Mary Poplin, and you can find us online at www.borisfx.com.